I guess it was the beginning of the season. My home team, my loyalty, I'm at up to Back in September, I received two different Commander songs from fans. One was kind of a uh, rednecky country thing. Remember that guy? I'm a Commanders fan. He cut the thing in Nashville, Tennessee. I played it. I didn't get much from it. I heard this song and I went, "Wow!" Left hand up. To me, this song sounds like Washington D.C., my hometown, Chocolate City, the greatest city in the world, the most powerful city in the world. Got Joe Gibbs, you got a good chance. Let me tell you something about some good friends. Back in the day, RFK was our palace. If you don't know, you need to ask about us. Think we're going to lose. Well, I can't believe your doubters had the whole crowd screaming out. We want that. Yeah. Those haters can't stand us. Left hand up. Who are we? The commanders. So let's face it, we had a song. We had a good song, Hail to the Redskins, lasted us 40, 50 years. Not the Redskins anymore, and even though the team kind of changed the words. I don't hear that song a lot in the stadium. So I heard this, and I thought, wow. It's like right up my alley, this R&B, this sounds like D.C. And I had the guy on the show, DJ Woody O'Goody, and uh, I told him the song is a smash, and he's got to get with the commanders, and uh, we've got some news right now. Let's welcome back to the show. My friend, DJ Woody O'Goody. Good morning, Woody. Good morning. It's DJ Woody O'Goody. Yeah, it's good to have you. Good to have you back on the show again. Uh, The song that you made with Big 57, this thing left hand up. I know you have a big announcement, and and please share it with my audience right now about you guys and the commanders. Man, it is a huge, huge announcement. We have signed an agreement to perform the next two home game. Wow. At FedEx Field. Yes, indeed. I'm love excited. It. Love excited. it. Love it. Love it. Love it. When did this happen? Tell me all of the details. Well, it ha- it's been in, since the last time we spoke when I was on your show. Mm-hmm. We've been talking back and forth and, and trying to iron out a deal. And for me, I I don't know a lot of the details. I, it's like Greek reading Greek to me. So <laughs> I, had to, I had to share with uh, People, uh, a lot of minds that I know, once I shared it with a lot of different people and me and my nephew and his mother and my wife and my brother, he, he's a lawyer and his wife. And once we ironed out a lot of the details and, and came to the conclusion, we're ready to sign, that happened yesterday. So wow. we signed it. Wow. So, so you got it done. Did you, did you go out to uh, Commander's Park to sign or did you do the signing elsewhere? No, it was actually emailed to us, ah. and uh, we was email we was emailing back and forth trying to make sure we can understand the language yeah. that, that was being spoken in there because it, it was it was a lot. All right, well, but let me, long, long story short, we did it was by email. Let me let me get a couple of things straight here. You're going to be out sure. there the next two games. When are you performing your song during the Giants game? Okay, where where it stands now is going to be before pregame before the game. That's where we stand right now, and I think that's what we're going to do on both of the game. I originally thought it was going to be halftime, but uh, yesterday he he explained that it was going to be like before the game. Well, listen, that's that's a good audience, man. Are, are you guys going to be right at the fifty yard line? I hope, or are they going to build you a stage, or how's that going to work? Any idea? Well, I, I, I well I thought it was going to be on the field, but I from uh, we still kind of working that out. Uh, I'm not a hundred percent sure exactly where, so I don't. I don't want to say, and I and I don't have. I understand. All the information. Understand, and that and that game is still a couple of weeks away, so we got some time to plan on that. I'm, they're going to put you right, up on. Right. They'll, they'll put you up on the jumbotron, etc. Have they given yes. you? Have you? Have they given you any indication that they're going to be playing the song in the stadium during the game? Yes, that's that's in the agreement. Wow, so, and, that's great. Yes. So they're going to be playing. They're going to be doing it. I am. Yes, so, I am so happy for you, Woody. I'm. I am so flipping happy. How's Big Fifty Seven? How's Big Fifty Seven doing with this? He's he's a lot younger than me, and he's a lot more excited than me. <laughs> <laughs> but I am. I, I am excited. Don't get me wrong. I am excited. But and we're both excited. But he's. We talk. We talk like we we talk every now and then. But now we're talking 
multiple times a day. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm glad to hear that. Um, the song itself, I know we talked about writing it and putting it together, but this was your dream. You wanted some sort of yeah. a way for the song to get out there. I think yeah. it's just, just great. I heard the guys were playing the song in the locker room after the game last week. Did you hear that? I, I did not. I didn't hear that, but I'm, I'm glad. Thanks for telling me. I'm glad no. they are. I'm glad they are. And I did notice that uh, Taylor Heineke was familiar with the left hand up, and I know it was uh, Jay Leno did it last night on yes. uh, Channel Nine. So, so I, it's it's out there, and it's it's a great buzz, and I'm and I still feel like I'm dreaming. I heard people say surreal, surreal, and I'm like, what do you mean surreal? Now I know. Yeah, now you know. That was it was uh, Charles Leno was last night on on Channel Nine I'm News, sorry, right? I'm yeah, sorry. yeah. You said yeah, you said no, you said I'm Jay Leno. Right. You said Jay Leno. I know. So well, I just knew Leno. I apologize for that. No, no <laughs> worries. I know you're excited. You're in the spotlight. Um, what are you guys gonna wear? Have you thought about what you're gonna wear? Uh, I thought about it. I, I, first, I thought that I might wear what I wore in the video, but now I'm thinking I want to upgrade from that. So nice. That's still in the making. Nice, nice, nice. Well, listen, I am uh, thrilled for your success without getting into any details. I, I hope you got a few bucks out of it. Thank, thank you. Uh, we, we're doing well. I'm glad we're, to hear that. We're doing I'm, well. We, we sat, we thoroughly satisfied with the agreement. I'm thrilled with that. I'm I'm so happy the team uh, finally got on board with this and is embracing your song. Woody O'Goody, DJ Woody O'Goody and Big 57, you done made yes. it to the big time. I'm proud of you guys. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate you. Y'all reaching out to me. I, I love it. Uh, I was listening to that last that song you were playing, I was playing my air guitar saying, wow, he killing it. <laughs> yeah, it's great. It's a great It's a great song you've got as well. And uh, listen, Thank I'll you. play it. I will see you and meet you in person at the Giants game in a couple of weeks. Awesome. 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 Thank you so much you for having it. me. I appreciate you. You got it. All right. He's getting a little bit of fame, and that's a good thing for him, Mr. Woody O'Goody. Get your left hand up. Commanders Radio, 738. Don Geronimo and Washington's Classic Rock are on Big 100.